hey what's up welcome to another video in this video we are going to try out this package spacy media library so this is quite cool package because it allows us to save image associate any number of images to any model without needing to create another separate table to store images or separate column for images so we'll try this out on our fresh new laravel 8 project so first we need to require this using composer so i will show what i have done so first we require this using composer and it will install everything like so and once it is done we need to run this command to generate a migration file that will create a media table so once this command is run it will create a migration file and then you need to run php artisan migrate to create the media table all right so once that is done we we have to prepare a model for which we are going to save our images for for example if we are saving images for products we need to prepare the product model so that we can save images so right now i have only user model so just go to app user.php and in model where you want to create images you need to implement has media interface so you need to implement that has media and make sure that is imported and next thing you need to do is use interacts with media trait all right so that is also instructed on documentation preparing your model here you can implement that and same thing all right so once we have done this our user model is ready now we can save images for user and we can display images as well okay similarly if you don't want to do for user you want to do for any other model like product or any other model just do same thing like we did for user model okay so next thing let's go to browser i have created a i have created a form for you so i have a simple form uh, with document name and choose file input field and whenever we submit it will send request to slash form so here we are displaying images and we have link to download as well so let's go to route file and show what i have created so this is sorry let me make it a bit bigger so this is the get route which is loading form so i'm just uh, grabbing the first user and i'm grabbing all media files so we don't need to pass this you know we'll we'll revisit it in a moment and we're passing all the media for this particular user to form that's it so in form dot blade we have simple form simple upload form with document as a name for input file yeah we don't require this document name and just leave it for now and here we are displaying uploaded files we are just receiving files object or files collection and then repeating all files and just grabbing url so we'll revisit it in a moment first let's finish the upload part so whenever we submit this form it is sending request to slash form and in post route of form we are just validating we only we require this document uh, field so normal way of uploading is like this we used to do laravel way like this just grab the just store it in a documents folder and persist that on database as well so now we we'll no longer need to create separate table for storing images we have spacey media library package so how do we save the image we first grab the model for which we are saving file and then there is a method named add media from request 
so whenever you are saving file from form just call this add media request from request and the name of the form where which is input type of file and to media collection just this thing will save the image all right so let's try this out go to form refresh it we will choose a new file let's choose this file and submit it there we go so that files file got saved and we can see it here so let me show where it is saving so it is saving inside storage app public so by default there is public uh, disk if you go to app uh, media or config media library so here is all settings by default it uh, it is public using public disk so all disk are in file system config file system we have these disk available local public s3 so we can use any of them all right so here mm, we are saving it and so in storage app public we are seeing so it will create a folder with id and it will save the image so let me show you database so in media it will save everything on this media table and here we can see so these are the data it, it will save okay so once that is saved we we grab that file using user get media so it will get all the files associated with that model and that that we passed it here and we are showing that on form as i have previously showed as well just looping through files and just showing this on image and also to download we have set up a route called show route and we are passing whole object so let me show you the show route so just this piece of code to download the file how cool is that so we have show method and media and this media we are expecting the media object so you need to import this model spacy media library media model and we just need to return this model and it will automatically download so make sure this media and this media matches because it will resolve that uh, class this is called route model binding so from route it will resolve the it will resolve the media object and we are returning this media object and it will instantly download without doing anything so let's see that in action as well so whenever we hit download there we go it will download here we can see it okay so this is all about uh, uploading file uh, retrieving files and downloading them so there are a couple of additional methods like suppose while saving in post route while saving you can call you can save them on separate collection like personal pics or any official docs and later you can retrieve using same collection like here official so this allows us to save uh, these collection in let me make it official so this collection um, this collection object makes us easy to save sorry can't talk and write at the same time official yeah so saving in collection may enable us to whole lot of possibilities suppose we are saving a cover phase for image on cover phase collection and other sample images on sample images similarly for user uh, we can say uh, save official docs or official document in official document collection and profile picture on profile picture collection so we don't need to create all other database table 
for storing the separate collection or separate files all right so this is enough to get you started with media library package it's really cool you can check out the documentation and explore more yeah so that's it for this video i'll see you on next video bye